If you fire an ash charge in one of the top corners of a doorway, when you run through it you won't take any damage. Capital can fire a flame bolt through a singular bullet hole. When placing barbed wire on stairways, make sure it's in a position where attackers can't destroy it from cover and have to be exposed to melee. This can often just result in a straight up free kill. ADSing with Maverick's Torch makes the sensitivity so slow that it actually ends up wasting his fuel. For that reason, never ADS with his torch, just move your mouse more slowly. Shoot the glass out of windows so you can hear what's on the other side more clearly. If you time it right, you can throw a nade so that it'll detonate right as it hits a ceiling, destroying utility or even players on the other side. If you melee a castle barricade 8 times, it'll only require one more hit to be broken entirely. This can be used for things such as a quick getaway, or getting a surprise attack on an enemy. You can actually shoot Ying's Candelas before they detonate. You might have to take my word on that. If you pick up and replace a Thunderbird Kona station that's on cooldown, its timer will be reset, making it ready to fire again faster. Unless you're playing Kaid, never try and deny the container walls on Clubhouse. Bandit wires and mute jammers can just be shot through the drone hole. Never run straight into kitchen on Clubhouse when they're defending basement. There's a setting in the general tab of the options menu called drone after prep. It's set to automatic by default, but you can change it to either semi-auto or manual. Either one basically means that you won't be kicked off of your drone when the action phase begins. Similarly, there's an option on the Controls tab called Drone Deployment. Setting this to Advanced means you won't automatically jump onto a drone as soon as you throw it, which can sometimes save your life. If you ever hear the glass of a window shatter, just assume it's an Amaro about to come through the window, and be prepared to take your gun Also, um, uh, learn to pre-fire common angles. Literally, just pre-firing common angles can net you tons of free kills. As Thermite, make sure you're not placing your charge in between two walls. If you do, a bandit could trick either wall and still destroy your exothermic, so it's important to make sure that your exothermic charge is only touching one wall. Once you've found a good spot for your drone, swap onto someone else's to turn the lights of your drone off, making it harder to spot. If you encounter a mozzie pest that's placed by an exterior door or drone hole, reverse your drone into its radius and then jump it forward as it gets captured. This will permanently disable the drone after a few seconds, making it unusable for Muzzy. To prevent this from happening to you as Muzzy, you can place a pest at almost standing height above a drone hole to minimize the warning time that attackers get when they near it. You can change the color and opacity of your reticle in the accessibility tab on your settings. If you destroy the telescope and look at the base of the globe in Astro on Villa, you can vault on top of the globe and sprint onto the boxes to the left. This can get you usually at least one free kill. You can prep a barricade for a run out by shooting the corner piece and meleeing the yellow tape next to it twice. Stop banning Favela and play a map that isn't Clubhouse or Oregon for once. IQ can see defender phones while they're silencing a docker be call, giving her an opportunity to get a free floor bang or wall bang. I'm dropping, stop, stop, stop. You can get a very tight angle into blue on Oregon from outside by vaulting onto this generator. Watching the in-game tutorials in the learning area grants you a free 200 renown for each video. You don't even have to watch them either, you can skip them and still receive the reward. Set up drones watching the diffuser in a post plan and get your teammates to watch it so they can tell you when and where to swing. You can throw impact grenades through drone holes next to hard walls to destroy thermite charges on the other side. If you break the floor of stock room on bank and prone, you can get a one-way angle onto the open area window. Capcan recently got the ability to put multiple EDDs on doorways and windows. Since this update is so new, attackers aren't used to checking for more than one trap. Since two EDDs can kill most attackers, placing two on one doorway can often bag you a kill. 